everyone. Uh, this is a screencast demoing my New Media 445 project. What it is is a New Media uh, boilerplate that shows you um, in highlights all the HTML tag elements in a web page. So let's go to my web page right now. It's going to be at this URL, um, Arthur Olson .nmd, nmd projects net slash nmd four forty five slash nmd dash boilerplate. Um, I'm just going to show you around. Right here, what we have is just some quick mock up that I've done. Um, that's supposed to simulate a just a basic, very basic um, HTML document. Um, what I've done here is I've made a fixed navigation menu um, showing the different parts of an HTML page. If you hover over each one, it'll show you all the tags in that um, and how many there are. For example, there I have two aside tags in my document right now, and if you click on that, it will highlight the asides in there. Um, it works for every single tag on here and since the opacity of the background is set to 0.5 transparency it can overlap so if we go in here and we go into the A tag and we click that I do have one right here so it overlaps um, if you want to clear the um, whole entire document of their background color just come up and hit hit clear right here um, it also shows you the source of every single tag element on the page um, right here we see a total number of HTML elements found is 174 you can just go through and you can look at the code yourself right here rather than having to go into firebug or inspect the element And if you want to exit out of this, just check the prevent this page from creating additional dialogues. Otherwise, the this uh, function will go through the entire document through all 174 elements. Um, I've also created a quick grid system here. Um, if you want to display the columns, um, here they are in red. It's every column you see here is 80 pixels wide because it's based on a 109 or 160 pixel um, body layout. It also displays the rows. The rows themselves are based on um, a body font size of 16 pixels. So these are 48 pixels. It's 2.5 m's of the body size. And to clear that, just go in here and hit clear. Um, there's also a downloadable link right here, which when you download it, it'll pop up as a zip file and just unzip it and you'll have all the files necessary to drop it right in your code editor. Um, <clears throat> right now I'm just going to show you what I have um, for JavaScript in here just to show you what I've done to display all these things. This function right here is the function that actually displays a different color background for each element you click on. Uh, this function will clear that background. This function is just set up to display the number of each element on the page, how many there are. Um, and it's accurate for every single element on the page unless you're creating divs with JavaScript. It won't display the, the number of those. Um, these three uh, functions at the bottom right here. The first one is just to show the source. Um, it just loops through the source of every single element on the page. Uh, second one is to see the uh, rows and the third one is to generate the columns. Um, 
I created this just so uh, incoming new media students can see clearly where, or sorry, how much um, padding and margin their tags are taking up on the web page, and also to see what kind of tags are on the page right here. Um, you can drop most of this code right into whatever um, web page you're making just so you can see which tags are displayed and what the uh, box model is on those elements. Um, it's all open source. You can use anything in the zip file. Uh, you don't have to credit me and you can change anything you want on here. This is um, something that I made for everyone to use um, for free. So um, there you go. Uh, I hope this helps you all make uh, your own web pages. And thanks for watching.